Are you also having problems with some audio recordings not working well in Sony Vegas Pro 15? Do you have problems with files that refuse to work properly in Vegas Pro and just refuse to sound right? Come on, play. Come on, brother. Do you have a whole folder of MP3 files that refuse to work properly in Vegas Pro? but do work in your other audio players? How about your capture recordings? You recorded with the built-in DVR recorder for Windows 10 or some other problematic sources. Let me guess, you're here because you're facing these problems and want a way to fix them. I made a program which should fix all of these problems I'm splitting this video up into a few parts to help fix your problem. Someone in the comments on the last video I made, similar to this a long time ago, told me to put the video file into Audacity. You can't open MP4s in Audacity. It says that the MP4 file is an advanced audio coding file. Audacity cannot open this type of file. That's where we could end it off, but it's like, you need to convert it to a supported audio format such as WAVE or IF. Part 0. The intro to my converter. So when you open up my converter, you will have two tabs at the top. The first tab will be the very easy functional things we're using, and another tab which gives you a little bit of information on the program. The quick rundown of what this program does is this converter was made because I wanted to make it easier to convert a whole folder of songs to another format without dragging each into a boring website that would usually take 5 to 10 minutes each. I didn't bother adding in support for customization yet, but it will be added later. Therefore, it is technically just a remuxer software for right now. The quick rundown of how we're going to fix our problems is we've got to have a folder. No, not that folder. We have a folder of files. When you open up my program, you will have the ability to select a directory. You just need to navigate to where your audio is. So my audio would be in this PC, Music, Stream Music, Undertale OST, and Convert 2. So you click on this directory button and what we gotta do is match up the these buttons with those text things. So we click this PC, music, stream music, Undertale OST, and convert to. Click on OK and you will have it will you just click OK and it's done. What you need to do next is choose an extension like MP3 or MP4. Because our MP4 files are literally the files we have for our capture recording, the one that sounds awful, we know it sounds awful and we don't like it. And what you gotta do is, right there where it says from extension, you just type in MP4 because it ends in MP4. If you don't see this MP4, then go then go to this little tab on the top of the Windows Viewer and click View and make sure that File Name Extensions is checked so you can see which files are which, like MP4 and MP3. And that's how you will know what to name it. There are other ways of finding this out. But that's the most easy way. What you do in this program I made, again, instead of converting these things into MP3s because turning an, 
turning MP4s into MP3 did not fix the problem. What you can do instead is turn the MP4s into WAV files. But because we already turned some of these MP4s into MP3s, let's just convert MP3 into a WAV. So convert MP3 to WAV and then click Convert. And what does it do? It makes us a bunch of WAV files. So first we have the song we made that we were wanting to use, and then we also have the video that we converted. So listen to the WAV version of this video. We're all humans. Yeah, I hear myself talking properly. I don't hear awful noises like... You don't like joys like that. Again, with the music that you were trying to put in earlier, the wave. Yeah, the wave sounds good. You're having great times now. We fixed that problem. The problem where it's all distorted. Another problem you might be having is so let's say you have an FLV file that you just got out of OBS because OBS gives you FLV files by default. You try dragging that in and it tells you none of these files could be dropped in Vegas Pro. Oh no! What can we do? We can convert it to an MP4 and then it will work. That's as simple as it is. If you run into this problem with some other audio or image files, then just run those images through my program. This program is not just limited to audio and video. You can also convert images and subtitle files between each other. I don't know why, but you can. So you can change like an, a PNG to a JPG, or a TIFF, or a GIF. You can turn a MP4 into a GIF using this. I would think that's a nice way to start making GIFs, like make your little cool edit in Sony Vegas and then convert it, your MP4 that you did into a GIF. If you run into this problem with other audio or image files, just drag the just convert it to the corresponding format, such as JPG, PNG, BMP for images, MP3, WAV, or AUG for music. I think I covered every problem you might have with Sony Vegas. That's not true, but most of them are just problems that this program can help you fix. I will leave a link to it in the description. Thank you dudes for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, what? This is no episode. If you run into any other programs that you don't know how to fix right now, tell me in the comments and I will work on a fix for it. I will either, well, I will figure out a fix and if I can make a program, I will make you a program. Thanks for watching. I'll see you dudes later. Have a great day. Bye.